Hi, happy Monday. Hope you're all all right. I have just said this about three times and then coughed every single time. So it's kind of like, hi. <laughs> but yeah, hope you've had a nice day. Good start to your week. I have tackled the dreaded, the dreaded food shop. Honestly, I was not looking forward to it at all. All right, at all. So, um, yeah, I've been and done it. 100 quid, 100 quid two bags i mean this one's quite big to be fair but 100 quid honestly so do you know what listen right i started a series last night it's another harlan coven one all right and it's called the stranger is it the stranger or stranger i was all over the place honestly on the edge of my absolute seat on the edge of my absolute seat absolutely on the edge of my seat i don't know what i'm saying <laughs> i don't know what i'm saying absolute on the edge of oh fuck it all right but anyway i was proper gripped like i just couldn't stop watching it and i finished all eight episodes since last night i started so yeah i um i've done the food shop like in between episodes so yeah i've um <coughs> oh excuse me yeah brilliant honestly it's, i don't know what stood like this yeah all right it's brilliant it is, it's good. I ain't got a bra on today. I went to Tesco today, titty swinging everywhere. Honestly. Cough in the wrong direction, someone's getting a tit in the head. <sighs> but yeah, I actually took a pound today to put in the trolley, because usually I'm pissing around and I ain't got one. Or, I'll tell you what happens, it never gets in. I don't know if it's like the new shape pound coins, but I can never get them in. So I never have a trolley. Honestly. So yeah, I was prepared. I was prepared today. But yeah, a no makeup day, cannot be bothered. I've got work tonight, I am back at work, so no more time off for me. I, apart from a bit of an annoying cough, you know, I worked out yesterday. So I'm obsessed with doing that, that's really annoying, I know. Um, I worked out yesterday, I did. Getting it all this with a bar, honestly. I was on the floor, because I ain't got a weight bench, so I was on the floor doing my chest and arms Do you know what I mean I feel it all today so yeah I'm feeling good I'm feeling good back at work so and do you know what I'm actually going to pull the cooker out today and clean behind it I am it's grim so I feel like really cleaning like I feel like I'm back on back on top form ish you know it's just this annoying cough but yeah that Harlan Coben uh, series The Stranger I watched For Me Once because everyone was going on about that so I thought oh, I'll see what it's all about really good actually and then obviously others come up and yeah The Stranger brilliant it's, as you're all over the place you don't know what's coming next and for somebody that's not really into like TV dramas like series like that you know I'd, do you know what you get on Sunday night 9 o'clock or something that kind of thing I ain't into that kind of shit but yeah, really, really good. And Behind Her Eyes, I told you about that one. That was a really good one. There's another one I watched as well. What was it? Nearly Normal Family, I think it is. Really good. Honestly, all these like twists. I'm a proper TV drama girl now. Yeah. I've gone off documentaries, although I did watch as well. Sorry, I'm going on. I did watch. What did I watch? I'm more into the dramas at the minute, but I watched uh, American Nightmare. Is it called American Nightmare or American Neighbour? Which just come out on Netflix anyway. That was quite up and down and all. So, anyway, right. I'll show you all the bits that I got from Tesco if you don't want to stick around. I'm giving you my life story as per usual. So, yeah, and I keep tapping my nails. It's so annoying. These have got to come off anyway because I'm back at work tonight. So, yeah, I'll get these off. But anyway, if you don't want to stick around, I'll show you all the, the shit I got from Tesco that equated to 100 quid. So... Yeah, anyway, I appreciate it. My Instagram as well is fayj202 if you do want to follow me on there. But I've got some, uh, these have actually gone down in price to 94p. So they were £1.15. Well, they might have been a quid and then they went up to one fifteen, And now they're 94p. So I've got two. So just to keep topped up on cereal. Got a heat kit as well. This is just the Tesco branded one. I think this is about why do i want to say one pound ninety and then like the old el paso one's like two pound ninety why why am i thinking that i can't actually remember it would be very helpful if i gave you prices but 
I'm well shit sometimes at remembering. I can't think. Some stuff I'm proper spot on with and then this. I've totally forgot. So listen, they had a deal. Four for a five off. So I thought, you know what? I want to do burgers for the kids one day. You're actually better off getting a packet of mints and making smash burgers yourself. Bit of garlic powder, bit of onion, you know, bit of seasoning, whatever you like, whatever tickles your fancy. And then just roll it out, you know. I've got burger press, but sometimes I don't use that. You can use the back of a cup, your hand, get it in a nice shape. So I thought, oh, I'll get the kids some burgers. They're about three quid for four burgers. Not even branded, like real shitty burgers. And you know they're not going to be great. So I never opted for them. But I do know the boys like chicken burgers. So I've got bird's eye, 100% chicken breast. You get four. So yeah, these were four packets of, like there was like a mix and match for a five or. So I've got two packets of them. And then the bird's eye hot and spicy chicken and breadcrumbs. And then I've got the peri peri ones because they've not got breadcrumbs on. So, and I've also uh, got a, it's a, I'll show you in a minute. It's, I've been on the Tesco meals. They're the low calorie meals, right? They're not bad, you know, they're like three for seven quid. Just ready meals. They're actually really decent. And I always add extra veg to it and stuff like that because, you know, it fills you up a bit more and veg, is you know veggies veg in it like these look green beans one pound thirty for that big bag that's good isn't it so bought i've got some spaghetti they were like 27p one pound fifty for 28 chicken nuggets so but yeah these meals from tesco they're really good like there's some like the fish one i ain't into fish and parsley sauce and that kind of thing oh I think about growing up. Listen, all right, it's not my cup of tea, okay, but it's, do you know like in the bag that you put in the pan, oh, with peas and boiled potatoes, like peeled and boiled potatoes. <sighs> and then some pizzas. So I have got some meat as well. I think it's in the other bag, but I've got a uh, pizza, so got those and then these ones as well so these are not bad like i say you know you get a good amount of topping on and then a couple of these for me as well so just because i am back at work this week starting from tonight so yeah um it's just like, like i said add some veg to it it's just an easy meal about 85p really really good for the price oh i also got this so this was on offer this is usually about 450 and I have these in the sachets. So they are the Options Belgian Hot Chocolate Salty Caramel, 38 calories per serving of this. And this was half price. So I thought I'll get it because I'm spending whatever it is, 50p a sachet, you know. So yeah, it's usually expensive and I never buy it because I wanted to get it and I'm like, I ain't paying 450 for a bit of hot chocolate. But yeah, it's the low calorie one, 38 calories per serving. So when I seen that on offer, listen, these are the meals look. The show these. So I got this is 269 calories, and like I said, you can add veg to it, and it's so flavoursome. So this is the calorie controlled chicken and mushroom sauce. So that's the packet, and then it looks like that. I know it don't look very appetising like that, but you know when it's warmed up and see, because I can have ten of them potatoes usually. This why I ain't losing the weight. But obviously I've been really trying. And like I said to you, on Christmas day I weighed myself and I was 16 stone eight. I'm now 15 stone nine. So since Christmas day, do you know what I mean? Cause I've really, I have, I've really been trying. And like I said, I, at the weekend, I had like really cheesy nachos and like I had three, three dime lattes, you know, they're, yeah, they're, they're very, very nice and um, that kind of thing, you know, can of Coke. But yeah, it's knowing that, because usually it opens everything up for me, then I'm like, fuck it, I can't be asked for the diet now sort of thing. Whereas now I'm like, no, like that, that's all good. And now I'm like back on plan, do you know what I mean? So my meals like vary from these, I have HelloFresh, we'll have 
um like i wouldn't like say i'm not having it like this you know it's, it's all about like portion control now and like i said my portions were massive and i've really really cut down so yeah i'm quite proud of myself actually this is the tomato and basil chicken this is one of my favorites so i mean there's more potatoes than that one so yeah and that's only 286 calories I think that's really, really uh, decent, honestly. Like, it tastes so nice. Do you know what? I don't really eat rice. I'm not really a rice eater. But I like the this ready meal, so I thought I'd try this one. This one's more calories. It's 360, but I thought I'd give this one a go. So, yeah, it's the uh, it's a low-fat recipe, it says. It's the tikka masala. So, yeah you know it's worth a go see if i like that one i mean i like the cheap one so you know i probably like that one and then i got some of these quaker oats because they were 50p each this is what i have in the morning with a banana or blueberries so not this one i have the um it's like a is it blueberry and grape or blueberry and apple <coughs> well anyway this is quaker caramelized biscuit flavor caramelized biscuit what's that about so yeah, what's this? 210 calories, and the other one's 209 anyway. So, yeah, I got a few of these because I thought it's a nice it, switching it up, you know, switching the flavour up. And then some Kit Kat chunkies, some pasta, um, more of these. So, yeah, these were supposed to be like £1.50 each. £1.50 each, piss off. Honestly, got some apples and some roast potatoes as well because I love to make my own roast potatoes and sometimes, you know, I can't be bothered. Honestly, I can't be bothered. So it's just one of them, you know. And then I've got some butter. Uh, things are going in the window now. A stack of potatoes. These were like £1.36, some Mary's Pipers. So again, just, you know, they're big enough jacket potatoes because I looked at the baking potatoes and honestly I got a pack the other day and they were about that big with a little nipple bit on the end. I took one look here and luckily I had one spare one going in the fridge. I put it in my veg drawer and it were a big one. So I thought I ain't gonna fill anyone up. So yeah, these were a pound each. I always have stuff like this in for the kids. You know if they're going from school and they want a little snack or something. Same with these, like cheese strings. They were a pound, these were a pound. So I've got three packs of cheese strings. You know, and obviously it helps with the packed lunch and stuff if they want to switch them up. So my lads vary from pasta to wraps to sandwiches to anything like that, you know, stuff like this. Got some crab sticks. They're Steve's, they are dairy milk bars. But yeah, I say crab sticks. There's not one bit, not what? Not one bit of crab in them. But yeah. I really like them. Some Philadelphia. Oh, bloody hell, there's all airs on the bottom of this. That's because my bag's area. So, you know, we take your own bags, don't you? Got some lettuce, crumpets. See, my Tyler, he loves that. He could have the whole packet Tyler with this. He loves them. Got some beetroot as well. Uh, pasta sauce we had well i didn't the boys had spaghetti bolognese last night and i made my own sauce but again sometimes it's just easy just to have it in more crumpets block of cheese a milkshake i didn't get that that was steve that i did get two packs of baby wipes and some ketchup so that's the first bag so come here all hanging out hey did you hear the wind last night honestly my garden's all over the place i need to sort it out just taking a look at fucking everything. Got some milk. Can't find a big one. I never can find big ones. So, <laughs> I've got two little ones. Um, you know, so I can't find 30 bags of crisps. Used to have a 30 bag or 30 box. Well, I did today in Tesco. So, yeah, this was about four quid, four fifty. So, they did have 20 Walker's ones for 385 on the club card, down from 485. But 30 just goes further, so got them. Oh, these look nice. Got them as well. Alpen 70 calorie bars. So, 
I grabbed them, they were on the reduced. So porridge. And then there's not much in this one. Some pickup bars. I had to scan the freezy see before I come out. So I was like, right, sausages, check. There's some chicken of some sort in there. Um, I'd already like prepped chicken breast as well. So that's like all seasoned and prepped, just needs defrosting. So I was just like scanning everything. I think there's half a pack of mints in there. Just, yeah, all sorts. So, do you know, just before I went out, I'm like, right, what have I got? But yeah, I've got four, four tins of beans. Uh, this weren't bad, you know. £3.30 for chicken drumsticks, all of them. We could do so many different things with them. So yeah, I thought, right, I'll grab them. 3.30 for all of them. That's a bargain. And then I've got chicken. So I'm with the lads. I don't know if some are roasting it tonight or I don't know. And then, I don't know what I might have done for heaters actually, so I got these. So diced chicken breast, I don't for heaters. Oh, I'm having my meal. Well anyway, I've got some uh, diced chicken breast out of three quid. And then some more mints. This is little, but they didn't have any shower gels. So Imperial Level Pampering Body Wash. And that was a pound. It is very little. But I thought I'd get it anyway, just because I've got shampoo and stuff. Um, bubble bath, but yeah, I need some, some of that shit. And then the last thing I got, oh, chopped tomatoes to go in with fajitas. I got a chicken soup, a mushroom soup, and a broccoli and stilton soup. So I like soup as well. But yeah, that is everything. So we get this away now, and then I'm going to tackle a bit of tidying. I tell you what, I did forget wash tabs because I think I'm running down. It's my phone. I ain't got a case on my phone at the minute because when I charge it, the case is too bulky, so I have to take it off. I forget to put it back on. Yeah, I knew it. Down to one last pissing tab. I knew I forgot some. <coughs> I'm going to have to go out and get some because I need to get washing done and shit but anyway yeah i'm gonna get it all packed away now so yeah just i'll show you everything that i got because i haven't done a big like a big food shop in a while so i thought right i'll just you know have a quick scan of the freezer see what's what go out and get a bit of a shop so yeah anyway have a nice evening won't y'all whatever you're up to don't let any dickheads get you down you're absolutely fucking amazing all right always know it make as you are all right i love you i'll see you tomorrow's video Oh, I've got some toilet roll as well. Stuck one in my downstairs toilet. Anyway, I'm off. <laughs>